Dun, 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 dun. Hey y'all, how's it going? My name is Booper Song, and I'm coming to you with a new video. So as you can see, I do have my nails painted now. I do have my hair did and I did get piercings. It's part of the reason why I wanted to make a video even though I didn't gather up too much stuff to show off. But I do enjoy a lot of these items and I wanted to show off not only what I picked up from Las Vegas, which I just came back from a week ago, as well as just some hobby stuff that I have. Um, technically they are clothing, but not, not the clothing you guys are here to watch. So I hope you guys stay around to look at that. And I will be showing off my room because someone did ask me to do a room tour. So there's that. Um, so the main thing you probably came in from the title for is a uh, Chrome Hearts pickup. In Vegas, I picked up this earring, which was also the reason why I ended up getting my ears pierced to begin with, because I wanted to start wearing more earrings. And then the Chrome Hearts jewelry was one of the ones I've always been looking at to get into it. Another thing that I picked up, which I'm not too sure if I want to keep yet, but I think I may, is this uh, Chrome Hearts trucker. It's just very standard. It just says Chrome Hearts Hollywood has the the little uh, nugget on top. And I will say this, the after having it in hand, the trucker hat just feels like they put it on a blank and um, the quality is not really that great. But like at some point, we're just you're just paying for the name at that point, like Sure, it has silver on top of it, but it's nothing too like amazing. So not really else much to say about it. Um, so my next pickup would obviously be climbing shoes. Um, climbing has become a bigger and more relevant hobby in my life recently because I just enjoy the sport. Um, in climbing, mainly I'm doing bouldering. So my shoes not super aggressive because I'm not at such a high level yet. My uh, max is probably like a V3, which is uh, intermediate. The progression is uh, halting, but my technique isn't too great. So I do see why. One of the next things that I did get is this organic bag. Um, I really enjoyed the color of this. This one, um, it kind of reminded me of like CPFM for some reason, like the color blocking. It, I don't remember which piece exactly, but this is a chalk bag, many different compartments in it. It's very nice. So there's a uh, many um, like holes where you can put uh, just tape for your fingers when it rips. And there's a zipper to hold your valuables. This is just to hold it when you fold it over. And it's, it's closed by um, Velcro. And there's two flaps right here where you can put in brushes to scrub off chalk on the holds. And then another thing that I got recently was this, uh, chalk bag i'm just trying to show you it's an arcteryx chalk bag um it's kind of in my opinion kind of shit mainly because i don't like the opening at the top you can't really close it or anything so it's just uh chalk can come out of your bag when you move it around too much so that's one of the main issues i don't really like that bag i may or may not get a, a better bag in the future because i can't always just keep it in this bag because i just um got some chalk that I'm gonna be filling up this uh, uh, bag with. And technically these uh, organic bags are called buckets so because um, you fill a lot of chalk into it. Um, so next up, what I wanna talk about is this Tiembo, Tembo chalk. This thing is insane. Like this is probably like the best chalk I've ever used for climbing. Like it's so fine and like it's so smooth like Every time I dip my hand in it, no matter how hot the weather is for some reason, it's extremely cool. Like, it's cold to the touch. I don't know how they do it, but it just it's just so amazing. Like, I love this chalk so much. I've used my cousin's. He got it from his climbing friend as well. And he's all, my cousin's also a climber, so it, it obviously makes sense why I'm trying it from him. But this, this is insane. And, like, this is what they gave with the chalk, which I thought was a very great gesture. They gave this sticker. And then they also gave this pin. So I can put this pin on my chalk bag. I probably will actually. And these stickers I'll probably put on my hydro, but that's about it. The organic bag also came with a sticker. 
very nice as well it's back here i do apologize but as you can see here the chalk bag came with that and then the arcteric bag came with an arcteric sticker i don't have it on me currently but it's outside and it's amazing i love it next up i wanted to show off where these pickups that i have so you guys get to experience a pickup video Woo! i already know what's in here i just haven't opened it yet so my pickup is dun, 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 dun. what i got are the two unique glow gundams yes the unique glow gundams here we have zaku and then here we have rx78 i'm not too big of a gundam fan i did mainly get this because i thought they were memes because look at them they're unique glow they're unique glow gundam how can i not look at them as a meme so I just got it because of that. Um, recently, the prices on them have been going up a little more. So that's the main reason why I purchased them. I wanted to have them in my collection. Um, I'll probably uh, build them sometime soon. I'm not exactly sure when I will do that, but it will happen sooner or later. Um, so I do have this sticker that I got from uh, the brand that, or the, the company that sold me this is Mimori in uh, Japan. Um, I'm not really airing too much out because recently their prices have been going up a little more. I haven't seen anything too crazy, but they sell a lot of chrome hearts. The prices are pretty fair because I did get this for a very fair price. And I'm just going to show you again what the hoodie looks like, just so you know what I'm wearing. I don't know why I'm doing that, but whatever. Um, next up, let me show you this other thing. So the next item I have to show off is um, this um, mecha. This is from Valverave. Um, it's a dog shit anime. Um, first season's okay, second season completely ass. This is from my main, the character I like the most. I don't remember her name exactly, but you can see her right here. Um, just be warned, trigger warning, this thing does have a fucking rape scene in it. And she's the one that gets raped. Um, but yeah, she's my favorite character. Um, that's pretty much it for the pickups, I think. Oh, wait, I do have some more. Um, the next pickup I have are these Air Force Ones. I'm finally a basic bitch. I finally got Air Force Ones. They're my first pair of, uh, all-white Air Force Ones that aren't a collab. And... Yeah, I'm, uh, I actually like them quite a lot. They're, um, probably one of the better pickups I've had recently. Um, oh wait, I have another pickup. I never showed it off. Um, give me a second, please. I need to put down my boots real quick. Um, I had these. I picked these up from Kendrick. Kendrick E on, uh. Instagram. I got the Lance Mountains from him. Amazing shoe. I love them so much. Um, it's just hard for me to keep a shoe that has such a high value. Like they sell for like 600. Like I, I feel like I'm not able to keep them because of what high value they are. And then when the paint finally comes off, they're not going to be matching shoes. So like it kind of annoys me unless I get the black pair, but that's another added expense, but we'll see. Right, so now, now I'm just gonna pick up the phone. I do apologize if I'm shaky with the, the camera, but I just felt like I'm just gonna show off the room. So first off, my bed. I haven't made it yet. I just got back from the dentist, so it's a little uh, fucked. Here's my table, also fucked. Um, this is just because I need to clean my piercings out. I just got them a week ago. So that's why that's there. And then I have some of uh, some anime stuff right here. Keychains that I still need to use. That's a little dusty because it's been covered up. Yeah, let me clean that off real quick. And then um, I have this super cool fucking monkey art painting. And then there's just some Legos right here. 
yeah i got a a limited edition star wars one my girlfriend got me this dinosaur one which i'm in love with haven't made it yet but i don't because i don't know where to put it that's the main problem and then i have my mickey mouse uh steamboat willy that's my favorite mickey so that's why i have that and then here is my fumo collection my ronko shiki kaide and then um those are from idol master so i don't know if they're really called fumos and then i have a saber from i think a uh, fate extalia or extella and then i have chihaya from a uh, uh, idol master in a bean form and then yukari right there um i ended up getting my friend a new one a better one so that's fine and then i do have a flork of cows uh crusader plush right there ren shoho from Kankole, this fucking tiger that i thought was funny so i just wanted from a crane machine and then right here are all my fumo sueko or suako uh remilia uh pacioli Flandry, and then now I have Marissa. She's super cute. I really like her. She's one of the the, the ones that I really wanted as well, aside from uh, Sueko. So that's all cool. And then my figures right here. I have um, uh, Shokaku from Kankole. I have uh, Kuriyuki Hime from Excel World. Widowmaker. That, I have Booba right there. She's Shiki, the one from up there also, but from... Uh, some doujin artist drew it and then i have another kurikihime and then um this is grand blue fantasy and haruna from Kankole. and then more stuff from uh, grand blue in the front but then we have um we have uh what's her face uh corin from uh fire emblem uh kurumi and then i have a uh, goblin slayer and a uh, shield hero right there and then one more Kaida down here. This one's probably my favorite figure right here. This one is uh, Nab Nabe from uh, Overlord, but it's just done amazingly. And then we have Asuna right here. Got it as a gift from my friend Cody. And then right here, there's just a bunch of, uh, just a bunch of mats that I got from Comic Cat. This one probably one of the more expensive ones. I paid 90 bucks for this. This one I spent 150 on. And then a mouse pad. And then just more art and this. And then please don't judge me. I just have Stella Rosa sitting in my room because I've been having a hard time, all right? <laughs> and then um, I have um, uh, Deadpool, uh, Edgy Boy, um, Vader. And then I have a Y-Wing y that my girlfriend got me. And I do have a... I have this Keith Herring uh, longboard from Alien Works, and then uh, uh, you twit face um, Eric Costin board that my friend gave me back in high school. Let me uh, zoom out of this real quick. Can I do that? I cannot do that. All right. Some art my girlfriend made that I, I've been hanging up since high school. And then Akame got kill trash anime, but I got a free poster, so why not? And then I have the bear from fucking Oran High School Host Club right there. So based. I love that shit. And then that's my girlfriend right there. I'm going to block it out. And then this is my table setup. It's kind of messy because I put those stickers there. But this is how it normally looks like. I'd probably benefit from taking off this uh, notepad. Make it look a little more aesthetically pleasing. My uh, cable management is dog shit. Look at that. Yeah. And then we have a fat goose sticker right there. Shout out fat goose. Love you Yusuf. And then um, I have my Animal Crossing Switch right there. I have a little Nano Blocks that I ordered from Japan. Um, my friend got it for me, Andrew. He helped me uh, proxy it. And then there's a mess on the floor, so I do apologize for that. So I do have my uh, first first arrows, uh, Taro Washimi uh, necklaces hanging right there. I do have a Palace Ashtray. I do not smoke, so I just have it for pure looks. I have a bunch of pins here, mainly Disney. And I do have all my palace pins, and I do have a Flower Boy one and a Keith Herring one right there. My rings are right here. It's just a plain spinner ring, Mason Margiela chain link, uh, Tiny E chrome heart spacer, and then a Hysteric Glamour snake uh, ring. And then, finally, we have my plushies, which are right here. 
And then this one is from Japan. I enjoyed it a lot. I got a matching one with my girlfriend. It's a whale shark with um, some uh, stickers from Facebook that I used to share a lot with my girlfriend. And then here's just a bunch of other figures. I'm pretty sure you're all annoyed with me talking and talking about these figures, but here's a good look at them. Then my shoes. Um, let me put the put these bad boys back up here. So my shoes. I've reduced a lot of them at this point, so they're just uh, there's a small amount of them, and that's pretty much it. My restrooms right here, my closet. Um, yeah, all my Johns are right here. Um, more plushies, and then just just clothes at the bottom, and yeah, that's pretty much all I have. Um, let me just put this back down again. Yeah, so that's pretty much it. Um, there's not really much that I have going on in my room. Uh, but, alright, so this is the... <laughs> these were the clothes that I wanted to show off that I forgot to that I got during quarantine. I got this amazing, uh, beret. I don't want to say what brand it is just because I, I want to gatekeep this. Me and, uh, Cold as Ice, aka Archive Reloaded. <laughs> gatekeeping fucking annoying but whatever gatekeeping that shit um and here are some julius cargos i got from my friend uh fuck shit out my head hurts or something like that um his name's dave love that dude julius cargos amazing um i do need to repair the knee and the zipper because they're fucked but i love these pants this pair of julius pants i'll probably never sell because i got it from him but that's it Thank you so much. Have a great one. Bye-bye.